Should you order an open box MacBook Pro from eBay? I decided to order a 16 inch MacBook Pro M1 Pro open box from one of the largest e-commerce companies in the world. But was it really worth it? And if you're considering a new or open box MacBook from eBay, should you order one too? Well, let's find out. So here it is, the 16 inch MacBook Pro. I actually found this the other day from a seller who was selling a series of refurbished, used, new and open box Macs with some fairly steep discounts, especially with the M1 Pro and M1 Max MacBook Pro models. I'll put a link to their page in the description if you want to check them out. The model I picked up was a 16 inch M1 Pro Silver with 16 gigabytes of RAM and one terabyte of storage for $15.99. On top of that, they also applied another 5% discount at checkout, which happened to be an additional $80 discount, which brought the total price to $1637.54 after taxes, which sounded like a steal considering it was an open box. And it just so happened there was one left in the listing, so I knew I had to snag it. Three days later, I had it in my hands. But what was I really getting with an open box item from eBay? Well, according to eBay, Open box is an item in excellent new condition with no wear. The item may be missing the original packaging or protective wrapping, or may be in the original packaging but not sealed. The item includes original accessories. The item may be a factory second. See the seller's listing for full details and description. And here's what the seller said about the open box condition of the MacBook. The item in this listing is an open box in original package. Packaging may be slightly distressed. The unit powers on with factory settings restored and includes the original accessories. Please refer to the description for a list of accessories or items that are included. When I got the MacBook, the packaging was indeed slightly distressed. Knowing that the computer was also powered on, I knew it had to be used to some extent. Generally, when I think of an open box, one of three things comes to mind. A. The item seal was broken or packaging was open but never actually used. B. The item was used, maybe once or twice, then repackaged. Or C. The item was used modestly, but returned with all original packaging within its return period. So given the condition of my system, I would lean it towards either B or C on that scale. Upon inspection of the computer, it actually looked great. I wasn't able to find a single scratch on the case or screen, though there did appear to be a little bit of grime and dirt, which I was able to wipe right off. The next thing I checked for after booting the machine and setting it up were the battery cycles. There were 17 cycles on the battery, which did throw me off a bit since it did seem a bit high for an open box item. I know it's not uncommon for returned or even new items to have a few cycles on them, but the amount of cycles tells me it was used for a bit. It's not too bad considering the overall condition of the computer, but I was expecting it to be a bit lower. Honestly, this isn't a big deal to me considering the battery health is still at 100% and the computer's in great shape. I also had all the original accessories including the charger, power brick, as well as the Apple stickers and documentation. My experience with the computer so far has been great and honestly, it feels pretty close to a brand new system. I've had no issues with the computer at this point. The seller also offered fast two-day shipping and they even sent me a message telling me my system was shipped along with my computer serial number included. I even picked up some new accessories such as the midnight colored MagSafe 3 charger, which is actually for the MacBook Air but works perfectly fine with these machines, and an extension cable for the power brick and this protective travel case. I'll put links to these in the description if you want to check them out. So, was it worth purchasing an open box MacBook from eBay? While this might seem like a sweet deal, there might be a few things to consider before purchasing an open box MacBook Pro from eBay. 1. The seller reputation. Check the seller's feedback and ratings. Make sure they have a good track record of selling high quality products. I went through the seller's page and saw that they had pretty good feedback. Two, check the return policy. Check the return policy in case you receive a MacBook Pro that doesn't meet your expectations or has hidden defects. And three, warranty. Confirm that the manufacturer's warranty is included with the open boxed MacBook Pro. This should protect you in case any hardware issues arise. I would say if the seller meets these conditions, then give it a shot. I will admit this is my first time buying a Mac through eBay and although my experience was seemingly good, I understand everyone's may not be the same. So, if you're still on the fence and want to dive further into this topic, I actually suggest checking out Luke Miani's video on buying Macs through eBay, and I highly recommend giving it a watch. Well, that's it guys. Hope this video helped you with your buying decision. If you liked it, feel free to hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. See you in the next one.